and we're underway. Looking at these two men, I don't think there's going to be anything traditional about this one-on-one -on -one matchup. Between his sprint to the ring and shaking of the ropes, I'm surprised the Ultimate Warrior is still going at top speed. It's all about the Warriors in the crowd tonight providing an unending supply of support for the Ultimate Warrior in the ring. is the dive and unfortunately for him there was no water in the pool bulldog ultimate warrior in a little bit of trouble here but he's very aware of who he's in there with and what he has to do to rebound let's not get ahead of ourselves cole this is just a little bump in the road for him here nothing to worry about i think a lot of people right now are scratching their heads wondering how he let this match get so out of hand the end may be near. I like this. Nothing wrong with enjoying your work. This is all but a cover here. This is it. Escapes trouble there. The ultimate warrior just too fast for him. Harsh impact. Look out. Here goes Warrior. Slingshot neckbreaker. Nice. Ultimate Warrior looking a little uneasy. This is not where he wants to be right now, guys. If he oh, wants man. to win this thing, he's going to need to make some changes here. There's no way he can stay in this match if he doesn't find a way to fend off this attack. Corey, I consider myself to be hip and down with any current lingo, but I, for the life of me, cannot figure out what Ultimate Warrior is talking about half the time. <laughs> Let me tell you this. Whatever Warrior's saying doesn't matter. It's just energetic and fun. I say we should all just fuel the spaceship with the rocket fuel and enjoy the ride. Maybe even Saxton could let himself be trampled by the raging elephants. Easy, man. On the topic of Warrior's far-out statements, I will forego the option to be trampled by elephants. I also don't want to be opening it. Looking for a repeat. This is what makes him one of the best oh. in the business. So you put an exclamation point on the end of a match, guys. We got a cover. I wouldn't have been surprised if that was it. Wow. Not yet. Oh, right to the body. That hurt. One of the Ultimate Warriors' crowning achievements came at the first ever SummerSlam. The Hoggy Taunt Man was in the midst of the longest ever Intercontinental title reign. Cue the Ultimate Warriors music, and in about 30 seconds, the Warrior had his first championship in the WWE. Uh, I think this is a deep six. This one's over, guys. Looking for all the glory here. And he got a near fall out of it. Yeah, it's going to take more than that. To add more to what Michael said about the first SummerSlam, the Honky Tonk Man was running his mouth for over a year, but was instantly shut up when he heard that first roaring chord of the Ultimate Warrior's entrance. With a close lock. Here we go a second time. Deep six. Here's the cover. 